Hello, in this video, I will show you how to integrate your ACF repeater on any pages of your website with Elementor. So the first things it's to have plugins installed like ACF Pro because you need the pro version to use and create some repeaters. Also, you need Elementor free and pro version because we are going to create some templates. And of course, you need our plugin Elementor repeater for ACF. When it's activated and installed, we are going to create first our ACF. So in this example, I will create and ECF clubs. Inside, I will create a repeater field called mon partenaire, so my partner in English. And inside, I will create four fields. The name of the partner, the image logo of the partner, a link, and a description, a field, a text field. Okay, so when it's created, I will link this, um, this field, the ACF group, to a pages because I don't want to hide it in the WordPress menu like you can see here, clubs. But you can add here if you want to. If you don't need to link it to a page, you can create a custom post type and create a menu inside your WordPress. So as you can see, I will display it on post type is equal to page. Okay, I click on save changes and now I go to my pages and I have added it to this page. Okay, so now you can see I've had two partner so with a name picture link and description so when it's complicate completed sorry uh, you just have to click on update after that we are going to create our repeater design for the loop so the unique uh, repeater so we are going to create for one line only so for this step, you need to go on template on Elementor to click on all and add new. Then you are going to choose a container or section if you don't have the new version of Elementor. Then on this new template, you will see at the end of your Elementor widgets two new widgets, the ACF repeater and ACF repeater post. So for this first step to create the one repeater loop, you need to use only the ACF repeater widget, not the ACF repeater post. So in this example, I've added one container with inside one widget ACF repeater. Inside this, I will choose the repeater data. So it's my partner. It's the ACF I've previously created. Next, I will choose the field I want to display. So in my example, it's the logo, the image of my partner. Next, repeater post for preview. Okay, I will choose the post where I have put my repeater to have some preview so I can get the images. So yeah, it's my page calendrier. So here you have to choose the, the page of or you custom post type where you have placed your repeater to have the preview like it's right here. So now repeater to preview. 
you will see zero, one, or maybe two, three, four, five. It depends on how many repeater you got, you have on your repeater ACF. So repeater to preview, if I choose one, and if I go back to the page where I have my repeater, you will understand very quickly. Here it's one, two, so yeah. In database, it's called zero and this one one. So it's not very a problem for you because if you want to preview with the one, the, the first line, you just have here to switch to zero and you will see the images of the girl, yeah. So next, type of field, it will ask you to set the type of your repeater field. Here it's an image. If you don't set image, you won't have the style option here associated to an image. It's just recapitulate here. With this option, you will have design options in style tab. Okay, so next I will add so one, two, three widgets ACF repeater, as we can see previously. So when it's placed, I will set up the same things. Repeater my partner, repeater fill name of partner, repeater, repeater post for preview my calendar page, repeater to preview one, if I put to zero, it's my partner too, okay. It's a text field this time and it will ask me is clickable if you want to make a link so you can make a link if you check yes it will ask you the link you want to to, to link to this uh, text field so yeah the link it will be this one the link you create in your SAF so when it's done and you're okay with your design just click on submit or publish or update. Next, you have to integrate where you want in your page, your Elementor, Repeater. So I will integrate on this page. I click on edit with Elementor and my Elementor open. So now I go down and you can see here, I have integrate my Repeater. So to integrate it, you need to scroll down on your widget and here you will use this time ACF repeater post. This widget will display all your repeater linked to this uh, page or the ACF repeater you want to display and you will say, okay, I want to display this repeater but with my previously designed. So I click on the repeater widget here and as you can see here the configuration we have repeater so it's my partner the ACF group we have created previously I will select a template so here I select the template we just created here so you can see it's repeater club the name so I re I will select it repeater club I can select a skin on grid or carousel mode I will I will choose grid for our demo and you can set the column you want to see here on in line on one line and you can switch to Mansory or not and it's okay because all the other things it's just some design so you can basically create it and design your single repeater loop right here on the previous uh, template you created for the loop. Okay, so I think this is just um, okay and you don't need to know much more to create your loop and your repeater.